A movement to help wipe out kids' school lunch debt is gaining some momentum on Facebook. This post has already turned into thousands of dollars to benefit Forsyth County families. As 11 Alive's Liza Lucas explains, the idea traveled across states starting with a single act of kindness by a child. Meet Holden, a six-year-old in Texas who had a friend in need. Holden was asking for extra lunch in his lunchbox. He must have been extra hungry, his mom thought. So a few weeks later, the little boy ran up and gave her a hug when she visited the school one day and said, thank you for feeding me while mommy's having hard times. Andrea and Elsie right. watching the story from a thousand miles away in Georgia as Holden's mom started paying off kids' school lunch accounts one at a time. And I thought, well, we're in Forsyth County. We have a big county and a community. I thought, why not schools? Andrea posted the idea on a Forsyth County Facebook page and soon the call started, raising $3,000 in just days to cover the debt. These are students who might not qualify for free or reduced lunch, but they might have, you know, circumstances and challenges that come up. The district lets students charge a set number of meals when they don't have enough money in their account. When families hit the limit, all of our students will always be fed. Um, we have often had you know, cafeteria workers or teachers step up as well and buy something for a student. Andrea is a working mom who can sympathize. I've had to reach out and beg, don't hold it against my child because I'm not able to provide at the moment. So I think that's what we need to bring to light. So with the help of social media, she hopes to spread awareness across Forsyth County and beyond. Everyone's not looking for a hand out. They're just looking for a little help up. What a great idea, Liza Lucas reporting, because kids, if they're hungry, how can they focus in school? Andrea hopes to not only help Forsyth County students, but also extend support across district lines to many other communities. If you'd like to be a part of this, you can check it out on 11alive.com.